G'day, it's Anthony from Your World Outdoor Blinds and Shutters. Just here in, uh, just near the airport in in, uh, in beautiful Adelaide. It's a lovely day out. But, um, look, we're just putting some plantation shutters in, into this uh, apartment here. And I uh, just want to show, I've got a couple of the frames up, but I just want to show the transformation. There's the, uh, the lounge room, here's the, the kitchen. So there's some tile detail there, and you'll see the You can see the tile comes a little, little part way out to which there's some packers in there just to fill that. Um, we'll go back over and we'll show you the, the other room. So I haven't done anything in here yet. So I've just set the frame up. So you can see the plantation shutter frame there. There'll be four panels. So I'm making them smaller panels. Um, just because they they're a, bit, they're a bit nicer, the smaller panels on an 89mm blade. But you can see that uh, that's the before. And then this little one in here in the second bedroom. So they're the four we're going to put in. I'll go finish off these frames, start putting in the, uh, the panels, and uh, yeah, we'll have a look after that. Alright, here we are in uh, Brooklyn Park. I, I, I had looked it up, we are in Brooklyn Park. Finished them in, finished the plantation shutters. You can see from, from the outside here. You see they match in with those match in with those windows. Looking smart, looking good. We'll, uh, let's go around and have a little look. And this is a Z frame, so being the double brick home, so we've even just filled in against this Z just to really finish that off nicely. Now you'll notice that little recess at the top. So they've actually, we've actually um, had it put a timber in at the top just to, so we've got the same face here for the shutters. So this configuration, a window like this, we, this is what we call left, left, right, right. So what I mean by that is, this one will open. These two will open in the centre. And then this one on the right. So if we close those two outside ones, Close the louvers there. Now you see this here, this is what we call the, um, the signature series. There's very little you see, it's just this one tilt rod that connects all the blades. Now you actually louver it on the louver itself. What a transformation. Here we've got, uh, this is the kitchen. And I've just got the top ones open. This section here is, we have a mid rail in it. So because some of the shutters were tall enough that they needed one, it just adds a bit of extra strength. Typically we'll try and match up with some detail on the window for that. And this is the same configuration. Well, actually no, this is a left right, left right configuration with a T-post. It's a T-post, it's part of the frame. It's not on the window. There's a couple of reasons why you might uh, want to do this. See this has just opened them. Now in this situation it works really well because it makes the, the shutters taller than they are long, which is good. The other thing is, we've got a spot for the, the mixer here, so that way you can open the, 
in your kitchen without needing to worry about hitting your tap. Just open them all up. Beautiful. Coming around. It's the second bedroom. And then the first bedroom, bedroom one. So on that recess, you see the top recess along there where we've put that timber in. The other thing is with a sill like this and the Z frame, so the Z frame, the frame comes out and across the front, the face, we've still done a bit of filling here just to seal that properly. Particularly on these double brick homes, they can need it. Sometimes you can get away with it on a brand new build, but it does finish it off nicely. With the Z frame, when it comes down to a sill, like here, you'll see that uh, you, there's nothing for the Z to come over the top, so it is what we call a sill cut. So we just cut that, cut this piece off, and then it just sits down flush along there. So you can see this is the same configuration in the kitchen, so it's left, right, T-post, left, right opening you can close all these bottom ones separately and just have the top ones stove those ones just above the, the mid rail that way you can let some light in there and still maintain your privacy That's all the four rooms, back to the lounge. I hope this helped. I uh, hope you learned a little bit about plantation shutters. If you're looking for plantation shutters and you really want to sort of, you know, just really uh, modernize a home and make it add a little bit of touch of class, get in touch with us and we'll be able to organize a beautiful system like this. Your world, outdoor blinds and shutters. Thank <laughs> you.